Miles, last thing I would ask you, your hometown Cleveland Browns made an interesting proposal. Explain it to the Peter King podcast audience. Well, what they want to do is move the trade deadline back a couple of weeks from week 8 to week 10. Now, this, I think, is a great idea, A, because I just have always felt like the trading deadline in the NFL is just a little bit too early. I mean, if you consider what it is for basketball, what it is for baseball, it's later in the season, I mean, especially in baseball. You know, you got it at the end of July, and so having it early on does not necessarily behoove teams, right? It doesn't benefit teams, I guess I should really say. Uh, so that's one thing that I think is really good about it. I mean, now when you have guys that get released, right, later on in the season, they go on waivers. They don't necessarily have, you know, the ability to control where they go and all these different types of things. I just, I love having a proposal like this because I think it would make the game better. You know, when you actually are able to trade assets for a veteran player who may be on an expiring contract or you have a player who, whose option you did, your fifth-year option you didn't pick up and he's not necessarily going to be a part of the team's plans the next year. Well, if you have a couple extra weeks just to see what the landscape is in the NFL, what if your team is actually good enough to be a buyer or if your team is bad enough to be a seller, I think that really can benefit everybody in the long run. So I, I love the proposal, and not just because I'm from Cleveland. I think it's a great idea. The longer you can wait, the better. Baseball's trade deadline being two-thirds of the way through the season is so much of a better idea because yeah. you have a great idea two-thirds of the way through the season exactly where you are. And in football, halfway through the season, you have a decent idea, but not altogether great. Hi, I'm Mike Tirico, and thanks for watching. Make sure to hit subscribe for the latest news and highlights from NBC Sports.